Hey, how's it going? Today I'll show you how to get the Next TV application to your Fire Stick or Android TV. The whole process is super easy and will take you only a couple of minutes. First of all, you'll have to get an app called Unloader. You can actually get it for free from the official Amazon App Store. To do so, we we'll just go to Search on your device and start typing the loader in the search bar. And as you can see, the loader has already popped out for us at the bottom. So we'll click on it and that's the app which you need to get to your device. But after you got the loader, it's not over yet. We still need to set it up. So in order to actually set up the loader, we'll go to settings by clicking on that button with the gear icon, and then we scroll down and go to my far TV. Open it. And from here, we'll have to turn on the developer options on your device. But on some Fire Sticks, and especially on the new Fire Stick devices, the developer options can be hidden by default. So, if that's the case, and you cannot find developer options anywhere, no need to worry, it's actually easy to make them appear. Just go to About, select Fire TV Stick, and now you have to click on the middle button on your remote for 7 times, and do it fast. So, let's do it. As you can see, now the bottom for me it says no need, you are already a developer. That's in my case. And in your case, it's going to say that you have become a developer now. So, if you go back a bit, you will finally see developer options, which have appeared for us right here. Let's open them, make sure to turn on the ADB debugging, then go to install unknown apps. From here, just locate the loader and turn that option on. So what it does is going to allow you to install other applications from the internet and not necessarily only those apps which are only available in the official Amazon App Store by default. And that's exactly what we're going to do right now. So now finally let's go to the list of apps on your device which is right here and there you'll find the loader which is set up and ready to use on your device. But before actually using the loader there's one more thing which I always recommend doing. It's of course connecting to a VPN. In my case, I mostly use NordVPN. Because they're super fast, we got a great app for Fire Sticks, Android TVs, phones, laptops, or pretty much any other device you may use. And they're not expensive for such a premium service. In fact, they cost less than a cup of coffee per month, which is great pricing for us, the users. In a VPN app, you just connect to any server. Let's say I will connect to Estonia right now. And from the moment you connect, all your traffic is going to be totally encrypted. It means no one can track you or snoop on you online. And that's really important if you want to stay out of trouble. And if you don't have a VPN yet, but you want to try it out, I do have a great offer for you. If you use my link, which will be in the pinned comment below the video or in the description of the video, you'll get 3 months of NordVPN totally for free, which is an amazing offer. And if you're watching this video on your TV or on your Fire Stick, then just grab your phone or your computer, open up a web browser and go to topvpnoffer.com. That's my website, which is going to give you the same amazing deal for NordVPN with three months for free. Or just scan the QR code, which you can see on the screen right now with a camera of your phone. It works the same way and it's also going to give you the same deal for Nord. And now, finally, let's use the loader safely. So, we just open the loader application, wait until it loads for you. Then, here on the left side menu, it's very important that you click on Home and not on Browser. So, once again, make sure that you have clicked on Home, and then in that search bar, we'll need to enter a link, which is going to be app dot next TV. Dot fr. So here's the link, you can see it on your screen right now, make sure to enter it exactly as you see and do not make any mistakes, because obviously if you make a mistake then the link is not going to work. After that you have to click on go and while the website is loading make sure to subscribe my channel so you would get even more content about fire sticks, as well as please hit the like button below this video. It truly helps me a lot, and this way I'll be able to create even more videos for you. And then, after the website opens, you just click on Download Now button, then the website will scroll down, and you have to click on the Amazon Fire TV button right here. Now we click on it, 
and in a couple of moments Vitan Load is going to start. Usually, it doesn't take long, but of course, it all depends on the connection speed on your device. In my case, I've got a pretty fast connection speed, so it will take us just a couple of minutes. Sorry, seconds. And then, click on Install, and in a couple of moments, the app is going to be installed to your Flower Stick or Android TV device, depending on what kind of device you're using. And after the app was installed, don't click on Open yet, instead press on Done, because this way we'll be able to delete the installation files, as we don't need them anymore on your device. So click on Delete and then Delete once again. This way we get rid of unnecessary files from our Flower Stick and save yourself some free space on your device. And that's really important, because you don't have too much of free space on your device anyway. Then finally, let's go to the list of apps on your device, which is right here, let's open it, and there's the next TV, which we just downloaded. Now, I would recommend you to click on the Options button on your remote, that's the button with three horizontal lines. Click on it, and then press on Move to Front. This way, next TV is always going to be at the very top of your application list, and therefore it's going to be super easy for you to access the app every time you need it. Just don't forget to keep the VPN connected to stay safe and out of trouble. Enjoy and see you next time. Bye bye.